नेक्स्ट वी हैव टाइप्स ऑफ वर्क डन मीन्स हाउ मेनी टाइप्स ऑफ वर्क डन वी हैव सो बेसिकली वी हैव थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ वर्क डन फर्स्ट वी हैव पॉजिटिव वर्क डन वट इज़ द मीनिंग ऑफ पॉजिटिव वर्क डन पॉजिटिव वर्क डन मीन्स वेन द एंगल बिटवीन द फोर्स एंड द डिसमेंट इज जीरो मीन्स बोथ फोर्स एंड डिसप्लेसमेंट अकर्स इन द सेम डायरेक्शन सो दैट इज कॉल्ड पॉजिटिव वर्क डन इन पॉजिटिव वर्क डन कोसाइन ऑफ एंगल जीरो डिग्री इज अ वन वन मीन्स अ पॉजिटिव वैल्यू नेक्स्ट वी हैव जीरो वर्क डन जीरो वर्क डन मीन्स when the angle between the force and the displacement is 90 degree okay so angle between the force and displacement is 90 degree so cos of 90 degree we have zero which gives a zero work done last we have a negative work done negative work done means when the force and the displacement okay force and displacement both occurs in the opposite direction so angle between them is 180 degree so cos of 180 degree we have minus 1 means negative 1 which gives a negative work done so we have positive 0 and negative work done so one by one we will see the example of these special cases so first special case we have free fall of a body so this is example of basically a positive work done by here force is acting in this direction gravitational force mg weight and displacement occur in this direction only so force and displacement both occur in same direction so angle between them is 0 degree so this is a here theta is 0 means angle between them is 0 so this is the case of positive work done okay so let's see the example example of positive work done we have in a free fall of body of mass m under the effect of gravity through a some height h so this is a case of positive work done next we have a coolie or a boy does a work on a load when he raises it up against the force exerted by a coolie and the displacement are in the upward direction now carefully see for example either it comes for a, for a boy or for a coolie okay so here the boy apply a force in the upward direction okay and the this this dumbbell this weight is having displacement in the upward direction so both force and displacement occur in the same direction so boy or a coolie does work done on a load which is against although the gravity but force and displacement both occur in same direction angle between them is zero so as angle is zero so this work is a example of positive work done next we have next special case this is a basically a rotational case so here this we have done in the uniform circular motion if you will remember there is one centripetal force acting in this direction and displacement occur in this direction so angle between them is 90 degree so cos 90 we have cos 90 degree we have zero so this is a special case of zero work done so here angle is 90 degree so if i am taking a circle here so this is the direction of force and this is the direction of displacement angle is 90 degree so this is a example of whole example of zero work done okay so now for example a man is standing with a heavy load on his head here angle although it is 90 not 90 degree but still this is a case of zero work done why because displacement is not occur here so in this case displacement is not there the person is standing at one place although he is applying a force on a body and there is no displacement of body occur so this is a case of zero work done next case we have this case we have seen in previous example a man walks on a horizontal ground while carrying a load on his head or on the side no work is done against the gravity why no work is done against the gravity because according to gravity its weight acting in the downward direction weight which is mg act as a force acting in the downward direction 
and displacement occur in the forward direction so angle between them is 90 degree so we know that cos 90 we have 0 and work done formula we have f s cos 90 although force is there although displacement is there but cos 90 is 0 so magnitude when multiply with 0 it give a 0 value so here because displacement of load is normal normal means 90 to the direction of force of gravity which is vertically downward so that's why this is an example of zero work done here theta is 90 degree so work done is zero so here you will see the condition for a work done by a force to be zero under what condition under two conditions when force is zero first condition we have when work done is zero when there is no displacement then work done is zero second when the displacement is normal to the direction of force when the angle between the force and direction is 90 degree that examples come under the zero work done okay next special case we have when a person throw a ball in the upward direction so in this case displacement occur in the upward direction and weight of this ball is acting in the downward direction okay so angle between force and displacement here is 180 degree and cos of 180 degree will give you minus 1 it means this is a case of negative work done so person throw a ball or a boy throw a ball in the upward direction so due to the gravity this is a case of negative work done let's see one more example of negative work done when a body moves on a rough surface as this body displaces in this direction displacement occur in this direction and force frictional force applied in this direction so this force and displacement are occur opposite to each other so angle between them is 180 degree again it is an example of a negative work done okay